Hello and welcome back to episode two of Deponia. So let's just get back right into it. Alright. So we looked at all this last time. There wasn't anything we could do. So let's head to the village center. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. What's going on here? I don't know, Rufus. Let's find out. There's a whole bunch of people gathered around. So it looks like a I haven't clock seen tower? such a crowd in front of the town hall since well, since since the mayor wanted to introduce a tax on the lack of political commitment. That tax would make a lot of money in this town. Um, so I guess we'll just go check out these Joes over here. Hmm. Uh, they didn't want to talk to us, I guess. Please form a line, people. Draw a waiting. <coughs> oh, draw a waiting number, and the mayor will see you in a short while. All What's going right. On here, did someone refill the peanut jar? A girl fell from the sky. They say she's a real beauty. The mayor is about to decide who's going to give her shelter. Yeah, well, I doubt he'll have a hard time to decide once he's heard my story. I saved that girl <laughs> from the dark exchequer. I am responsible for her. Nice try, buddy. But I've made up a good story, too. Mine even has a dragon in it. So nice. move to the back of the line and draw a number like everyone else. Okay, so... I guess we'll pull a lever to get a number. Number 66. Almost my lucky number. Cool. Number 66. Some magnets here. Let's take these magnets. Paper just didn't fall. That's weird. You'd think that those magnets would be holding the papers up. Oh well. Weird. Uh, let's see. What else can we click on? We can talk to Misak. Let's talk to him. The mayor wants to decide what? Who will what? Give her shelter? Lotech thinks the girl should be, um integrated into our community and someone <coughs> has to nurse her back to hell i hope the mayor will choose me she could give me a hand in the mud pits ever since i cut my fingertips while scrubbing rust i tend to get infected cuticles you want her to scrub rust for you that's outrageous why what do you want the girl for that is outrageous rufus that's rufus. A nice smile huh oh what <laughs> uh Okay, um, well, she doesn't belong to you, Rufus, she can't say that. She's a free person, just like everyone else. Um, well, how do I get do to the mayor? There? That's easy. Take a number and stand at the end of the line. Um, could, could you, you let me cut, cut in? in? See, I'm in a bit of a hurry, and... I see. Well, if that's the case... Do you want my chair? Shall we get you something to drink <laughs> while you're waiting? That'd be great. We could bake a cake for you, too. Really? Well, awesome. I like cactus cake, but no raisins. Thanks very much. And, oh. Let's yeah. See. Yeah. It's no, sarcasm. <laughs> um, where's, where's the girl? Where's the girl now? She's lying in the assembly hall. Dr. Gizmo is with her. All right. They say she's unconscious. I hope she isn't injured. So yeah, that'd be terrible. I. So do I. It's not easy stacking exhaust pipes. He said so by twice. <laughs> um, they do fantastic no, hats. Did I miss a trend or something? The roofer switched to making hats because it hasn't rained for months. Oh, <laughs> I see. And I'm sure the trousers are from the guy who used to make tarps, right? <laughs> hey. My wife made them for me. Well, thanks for nothing. So, so, okay, um, they probably won't make it first, so I'll just skedaddle. skedaddle. The hats were made by the roofers, and these three dudes live in town here. That looks like the first guy's hat, right? It has like a propeller on it. That's probably important. Hmm. Okay. Can't go to the mayor's office. They have to uh, get him to let me in. What about opening hours? The post office will be open. O'clock. O'clock. What o'clock? There's something missing here. 
<laughs> there is a piece. That's silly. Can't talk to them. Lottie. Hello, Lottie. You too. <clears throat> you too? Dear me. What a day. Where's the girl from Elysium? I know Princess they told us, but they might have been lying. Yeah, Princess Sugar Bottom? Oh, she's lying around in the assembly hall. Of course, I knew you came because of her. It's always the same. Always the same. A beautiful <laughs> young girl in a tight <laughs> jumpsuit falls in the sky oh. heavily injured. And immediately, <laughs> everyone's falling over themselves to help her. Hussy. Hussy! This has to be a man, I think. Maybe? Uh, I want to see the mayor. Let's see everyone. The mayor. <laughs> everyone does. Take a number and wait your turn. Okay, I have a number. Um, Can you make an exception, exception and let me in please? before the others? Please. It's your turn when your number comes up. No exceptions. Not even for me. Especially not for you. <laughs> Okay. I'll skedaddle. I'll Don't let the door hit you. There's no door. It's actually just an open hallway thing. Let's go see the girl. I think that's the best course of action. Goal! I have to talk to her. She's got to know who her savior is. Okay. Guess we're gonna try to talk to her. Rufus. Do you have to snoop around here? Yes. Hi, Inspector Gizmo. That's Dr. Gizmo. As you know, I hold all three positions in this emergency <laughs> station. Right now, I'm a doctor. And He's the doctor, doctor, the police, to ask, Why and the firefighter? My patient. She's an acquaintance oh my of mine. God. I wanted to see how she's doing. Her name is Gold. So, <laughs> the Elysian is an acquaintance of yours, eh? Very funny. Well, as long as your lacking sense of reality doesn't keep me from doing my job, knock yourself out. Look after your acquaintance, but make it snappy. Okay. <clears throat> there she is, Rufus. We gotta wake her up somehow. Rufus, stop daydreaming. That's not helping anyone. Stop it, Rufus. <laughs> That's enough. What? Come on. Enough daydreaming for today. My patient I agree. needs rest. Well, at least I guess that she needs rest. In order to know for sure, she would have to wake <laughs> up first. This is true. Conscious. What's wrong with her? What does she need? To be more conscious, obviously. Yes, obviously. Yes, she would have to be awake. Unfortunately, none of my remedies seem to work. Well, how about some really strong coffee? Ha! The coffee that can be of help oh here needs to be brewed. Doesn't every coffee need to be brewed? Yes. Yes, right, but... Hey, not to worry, Dr. Gizmo. I have a plan. Do the world a favor and spare us your oh. plans, Rufus. It'll work, don't worry. plans have never done anyone any good. Except that the mayor granted me a larger file cabinet for patients' histories. Okay, um... She's not gonna say anything, she's asleep. Gizmo here seems to not believe in us. There's a button here. Let's click the button. But it might be useful. Come on. Click. A uh, cardboard box. The balloons seem to have been stored here for quite a while. I wonder what occasion they're meant for. And why my face is on some of them. <laughs> uh, can we take the balloons? We can take the balloons. Can't take the cardboard box. That's fine. Let's close that door. And anything else to click on? Uh, doesn't look like there's anything else. We can talk Gizmo, but I don't think that's going to be important right now. So let's just leave. And what do we have in our inventory? Balloons, buttons, and then waiting number. Okay. We probably can't get in there yet. So, we need to find a, get, a way to get the line moving, so we can go see the mayor. Let's go to the water reservoir. This could be useful. Hmm. Don't know what to do. What do I do? 
Oh, I just fixed me over here. That's lame. Let's if I click kick the pipe. Okay, nothing happens if I kick the pipe. That's fine. Tap of reservoir. Make some dirty water. Um. Let's. Let's go. Can't go in that house. We can use the emergency phone. We go to Tony's house. We could go into Tony's shop. We could go to the alley. Let's go to the alley. Let's finish upstairs before we go downstairs. I think that's probably the smartest option. <clears throat> hmm. Hannah. Hello, Hammock. Blast signal bell. Hey, has coffee there? Hey, Hammock. Can Hello, we get that Hannah. coffee? Oh, hey, uh, Rufus. Exactly. <laughs> um. Why aren't you working? Yeah, why aren't you working? You're just sitting there. Why am I doing just the same? As you? <laughs> because some joker. Remove the magnets from the detonation plan. That's why. Hey, I am very busy, actually. I've been running around all day, getting things done and uh, picking stuff up and, 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 and things like that. Well, pretty much. How about actually, you find yeah. some new magnets for our detonation plan? Then we can finally continue work. Um, okay. Did you woman? hear about the woman from Elysium? Yes, but I really don't care. I already have a woman I can send into the mine shaft. It's too narrow in there for two women. Oh my god. Love must be such a wonderful thing. I the, all the guys in this game are so sexist and they abuse their wives. It's not fair. Um is that your is parrot? That your parrot? Yes, we it use it be. to detect dangerous fumes in the mine shaft. Oh, what do you do when that happens? We get a new parrot. <laughs> oh, I see. I see, because the parrot would die. That makes sense. Heck, you're, you're kind of a jerk, kind of a chill guy. I, I don't know. I'm not really a fan of you. Uh, you're not helping. You later. See let's you, uh, leave you alone. Rufus. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Emergency station, can we get there? The emergency station is closed for lunch? Oh, great. Well, what Ugh. if there's an emergency now? Exactly. My power-propelled satellite could crash into Kuvac. Or you don't have the that. Grizzlies could break free from my treadmills. I you mean, don't have Grizzlies on treadmills. On their feet here? You don't have Grizzlies on treadmills, so it's no problem. Hello, Mr. Perry. Hello. 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 Oh, I'm starving. I've eaten nothing but worms for days now. <laughs> Ignore him. My wife sometimes talks to herself when she's down there. He must have picked oh. that up from her. We can't meet anymore. <laughs> Although my husband is almost okay. dead, this bird has quite good ears. <laughs> huh. You're a terrible person, Hannah. I, I already hate you. Let's go into Lonzo's bar. We'll mess with the nation plan a little bit. Let's get deeper in here. Ah, Rufus. I thought you're on your way to Elysium. Have you come back to pay your tab? Oh, that. No. Oh, listen, Lonzo. No, I have I, Lonzo. Uh, I plan to do that, but constructing an escape vehicle costs a lot. And, uh... <laughs> Don't worry, Rufus. <laughs> no one here expected you to make it. <laughs> huh. Great. Thanks, I guess. Yeah. Nobody believes in you, Rufus. I sort of do. Lonzo. Yeah. But not really. Um... Did you hear Did you about the, the stranger? The girl? Yes, but I don't care. Don't tell me you want to start quarreling about her with all the other idiots. Well, you know me. <laughs> I'm always the first in line when... Uh... Idiots are quarreling. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Um... Do you have something that can give someone a real boost? Yeah. Since when are you ordering coffee? Did you break Tony's coffee machine again? How often do I have to <laughs> tell you that you don't filter oil that way? No, oh this God. is not about simple coffee. Idiot. I need something you tried that to filter really, oil really gets in you a awake. coffee kind maker? Ultimate pick-me-up. Lonzo, 
Are you okay? We need an alternate okay, pick here. Okay, just forget I ever asked. I'm off. No, no, wait a minute. I think Ooh, I know can exactly you help? what you need. You can help? What? That's... Is that an organ? That makes coffee? Oh boy. That's so this weird. Is it. This is the moment I've been waiting for. <coughs> hey. That's, wow. That's weird. Tanks? tanks? Valves? It's a it's a it's a thing. It's, it's yeah, it's a thing. Espresso machine. But this is not just any old espresso. Yeah, it's machine. huge. This is the mother of all espresso so that, machines. That I espresso machine gave birth to sell. all the other espresso and machines. You, wound ribbons you sure? Hair? Indeed, I did. Okay, but one question remains. What exactly is this espresso? Well, to be honest, I'm not sure. Man. <laughs> I think not? it's a kind of highly concentrated <clears throat> coffee. The people of okay. prehistoric times drank it. Uh huh. And the, then yeah. they forgot to switch the machine off. <laughs> I see. I okay. Think the compressor, following all the instructions that I found. Unfortunately, the pictures were pretty blurry. But I think I figured out what ingredients are needed. Take the recipe. It's right next to you on that bar stool. If you okay. bring these ingredients, we can start brewing. In the meantime, I'll have found my life insurance policy. I hope. Oh, 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 oh. I'm so excited. Oh, we're making espresso. Whoa. Okay, I need clear reviving and energy rich water. The coffee powder must be black, stimulating, and made from hot beans. Okay. Hmm. None of these things can be found in Kuvac. Ah, never mind, though. Being a master improviser, I bet <laughs> oh, I can no. find plenty of alternatives. I guess. I guess we could try. Um, there's a dart we can grab. Let's, let's grab that dart. Can we take the espresso? No, there's no espresso in it. We can't take that yet. Um, can we take the sign? Cool. Gladiators just didn't care and just ransacking everything as well. That uh, looks like everything we can grab. So let's leave. So we have to make an espresso. Hey! What was that? Oh. The emergency station is opened again. Well, that That's good. I can choose the more daring options now. Do we be daring? There's a million of here. Let's be daring. Let's go to the emergency station. Why not? Let's see what we can see. All right. Uh, what's all over here? Right next to us. First up, there's a lever we can pull. Doctor's cabinet. Can we open that? Crap. Locked. Distrust everywhere. <sighs> well, we were gonna take it. <clears throat> Makes sense, I guess. A dissecting scalpel. Excellent. Um, nothing else here. Let's pull this lever. What happens when we do that? <laughs> oh, but there's a dentist we could drive. Means I can fiddle around with his occupation modes unnoticed. <clears throat> Handcuffs. Let's open up the police box. <laughs> it looked much lighter lying in that cupboard. It did. That's not gonna flee. Foot fetters, okay. Um That's not gonna flee. Let's just get rid of that. Let's put this back up because there was another thing we could grab. Dinistro. Let's grab that. I'm sure it'll be useful for something. Or rather. That's gonna drill again, the, the lever again. And down again. And we have a fire extinguisher wedged in here. It's too heavy to lug around. Doesn't matter though, because I'm always cautious. Are you now? Okay. And we put this back in the cabinet? We can. Um, asbestos gloves. That's useful. There's a fire escape. There's a hatch. Um, let's move the levers up here. Again. Don't know why we put that back in there. Oh! Right. Nice! You got handcuffs now. Um. 
We need a key. There's a key in there. That's up again. Let's down. And if we go down again, there was this pole, and it leaves when you close this. But there's this hatch here, and there's holes here. I think we can leave it open if we use these handcuffs on the hatch. Yeah. And then if we bring it back up, will that work? That does work. Nice. Now this is open. And we can get inside there even when it's not turned. It's too heavy to lug around. Doesn't matter though, because okay. I'm always cautious. So we can't get that. Um, let's head to the alley. <clears throat> um, bye, Hannah. We have to go outside. Cause I think I know where that that thing pops out. I think it's over here. <clears throat> think. Th yeah, there it is. Now we can go up the pole into the emergency station. Wow. There we go. And now we have a lockpick. No great in the world can hold me back. Um. There. It moved. No, it didn't. Why you were blinking? It, it didn't move. Okay, so let's have a down now. Um, we need to find a way to wash the windshield. Hmm. Alright. Let's head down into Tony's house now. It looks like we've done everything we can up here for now. So we should head down to Tony's shop. Is there a way to go faster? Oh, double clicking! That's gonna make this go quicker. So chili pepper. Let's see if we can grab the chili pepper. Because I never clicked on that last time I was here. Ouch! Hot. It's hot. Um, we could wear gloves and try to pick it up. Perfect. But the gloves are gone now. Weird. But we have chili pepper. So that's good. Let's still have this pot of boiling water going. Looks like nothing's really changed in here. But I remember there was this first aid kit that we couldn't get to last time. Let's try picking Luckily, the lock. I'm a gifted lock picker. And we have a lock pick this time. What? Not even with this? What kind of a lock pick is this? What? It's a lock pick though. Maybe we could drill into the Luckily, box? I'm a gifted with lock the dentist drill? Damn. That would have been a piece of cake with the right tool. Oh my god, come on. Let's try Luckily, I'm a this? Lock picker. Scalpel? Damn, that would have been a piece of No? Really? Dart. The dart. Luckily, I'm a gifted come on. lock picker. Open it up. Damn. Damn. Come on. Uh, I think we had a chest up here? We can't- we don't need the bolt cutters? No? Okay. Where did my chest go? My chest is missing. There was a chest there! I swear! Am I going crazy? I swear that there was a chest up there labeled like from my dad or something. Well, that's- that sucks. That's lame. Um... Let's head back to village, I guess. Looks like we have everything we need from over here. We can't get into the medical kit yet. Um. So we can go to Winslow's house, or we can go to Tony's shop. Let's head this is into Winslow's house. He'll be flabbergasted when he hears about my newest <clears throat> adventure. I bet he'll be sure pretty he disgruntled he decided not to come with me. He'll start shaking and get crying fit. Um, Why am I not as cool and daring as you, No, Rufus? he probably won't get that. <laughs> I also want to experience such great excitement. 
but deep down in his heart, he knows that he just isn't cut out for this. Uh, He'll get seriously depressed. No, he won't. Oh boy, I really hope he's home. That, no, Wenzel. that's gonna happen. Hey, Rufus. <laughs> that was really fast this time. Yeah, yeah. This time, <laughs> I almost made it. Unfortunately, like so often, my human kindness got in my own way. Of mm. course. That darn <laughs> human kindness of yours. It's always getting into your way, right? Indeed. You never get anything done anymore. Well, there are just too many humans. They should all be drowned in the Red Rust Sea. <laughs> exactly. Oh my God. That no. Don't do that. By the way, Don't drown all the humans. All your stuff. I'm human. What? Wait, isn't that my chest? Well, you said I could have your stuff if your plan works out. But and your plan did work out. You just said so yourself, didn't you? Yes. Yes, but but. Well, that's settled then. Hmm. Um. Okay. Uh, maybe you can help maybe me. Maybe you can help me organize a few things. Again? You haven't even returned my lawnmower yet. Oh yes, the lawnmower. You'd better get a new one. The old one had lousy aerodynamics. Uh, <sighs> what is it this okay. time? Uh, oh, I think he's the I head think guy. I think I better do this myself. I don't Let's need heads. Honest, you were never a big help anyway. Whatever you say. True fact. <laughs> he wasn't never a big ever. help. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> what? You don't get it? Not a big help. Because you're small. <laughs> yeah, not funny. I didn't even get that. By you're the holding way, up the line. You're holding up the line. So what? As long as I haven't found a water vein, I don't even have to show up. Have you heard about that woman from Elysium? Who hasn't? This wouldn't have anything to do with you, by any <sighs> chance. Hey, you know me. Wherever there's a woman that needs rescuing, I'm there. You're mm. right. No, you're there not. There really does seem to be a connection. <laughs> okay, um... Don't Which you want to go to the town hall? To apply for giving shelter to the Elysian woman? The thought has crossed my mind. I even got a waiting number. But then <laughs> I thought, what have I got to offer? Yeah, nothing. <laughs> if I were rich or found a water vein, I might have a chance. But like this. Okay. Uh, can I help you get a water vein? I was there when Bang. the girl fell from the sky. It's all right. I'm sure it was just an accident. No, you're getting this all wrong. I saved her. Of course you did. Yeah. Okay, so Later. he's, he's exactly. not helping. Let me take Don't the even think route. about it, Rufus. It's mine now. But it's a family heirloom. So, yeah. A gift is a gift. Boy, I can hardly wait to give it a try. Maybe I can find a well somewhere near. And once oh I'm rich, <laughs> we'll split 50-50. <laughs> I might lend you the rod for a couple of hours. Don't even think about it, Rufus. But you said it's mine now. You said it's a, a for a couple of hours. So, oh, boy, me too. We'll <laughs> skip that. Okay. Okay. Um, well, if you won't let, give it to me, let's check upstairs. See if there's anything we can steal from him. There's a sponge. Yoink. Mine. We can open the furnace. Uh, nothing in there, it looks. That's okay. Uh, what else can we steal? Um, nothing. Okay. Oh, I think I actually saw something. Let's head back up there. It was right here? Right here. No, no. No, okay. My imagination. Back to the living room. Check the basement. Um, there's a pipe here. If my impeccable sense of orientation doesn't fail me, I should be under the shower right now. Okay. I'm gonna be a dick. I'm gonna draw a pipe, a hole through his pipe. Yeah. <laughs> Take that, Wenzel. Take that. You don't deserve that. Um, I have an idea. I have an idea, because that the, there's a water pump above his house. And that lets me make water. 
go into his house, I think. Um, I think it's up. But, and there's a there's that grate on top I saw that was closed. And I have an idea that it might require balloons Boy, how and fire extinguisher. people around me carry that thing screaming like babies? No. Balloons and laughing gas. Might as well inflate the balloons. I just thought I could do this. Maybe. Yeah, one will do for now. Okay. Um. But, yeah. Yeah. This episode's running a little bit long, so we're going to stop here. And when we get back, we're going to try to figure out what we have to do in Winslow's house. So, yeah. Look forward to that. If you like this, give it a like. If you have any suggestions for me, since I'm just starting up on YouTube, uh, leave a comment, please. And tell your friends, because I'll be posting here frequently. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye.